I got, um, my brother came by the other night and gave me my early birthday present. My birthday is on Tuesday. And, uh, you know, I, I like little sort of arts and crafts kits. Because, one, they give me something to do. And, two, they're getting to the point now where, depending on where you buy them and whose brand and all, they're fairly cheap. You know, some of them are expensive, some of them are cheap. I know big lots, you spend $10 on something that has, you know, 50 markers. And then it will, wouldn't even be Crayola, it would be $10 for 50 markers that runs out as soon as you try to write your name with them, you know. But, um, this wasn't part of it. I got this today. This is acrylic paint. I got this at the dollar store. I was looking for the little containers of post-it paint because I used to be able to get these you know normal size little tubs of post-it paint and I would you know use them because I watched this show called Art Attack and suddenly I have to buy paint tell me if that's subliminal or not but again you know they, I went to three places and they didn't have them I didn't want to go to Walmart so I said well I'll go to get it from here and hopefully this won't be dried out but anyway this is what he got me this is uh crazy art 165 piece creative art studio and i like the container that container can hold a lot and let me open it up and show you what's inside let me get it open he not only did he bought me this he bought me uh something else and i'm going to Show you that but inside you get uh, eight markers you get uh, three glue sticks I think they should just plain white glue stick they're acid free 24 crayons 12 colored pencils stickers very vibrant stickers too. These are kind of awesome stickers. For you got a watercolor paint set, and yeah, and you get a bottle of glue with a spare purple glue stick. Yeah, it is just. I guess it's purple. Color face it yeah. You get down on there. Um again he also bought me dump all this stuff in there so it don't end up all of them. He also bought me some twistable Crayola uh crayons. Now anybody wanna know I do love arts and craft kits. I love I collect a lot of writing utensils. I collect crayons and pens and pencils and markers. I mean, seriously, I got a huge box for them. But he got me some of these. He got me this 16 watercolor uh, watercolor set. And he also got me, and this is kind of fascinating. Because I so want to deal with this. I so want to mess with this. He also got me double-sided super tip crayons, uh, crayons, excuse me, markers. Um, you know, like this one would be red at one at the top and green at the bottom, brown at the bottom, orange at the top. But this is kind of great because, so uh, let's see, yeah, 20 markers and just 10 little markers. So he got me all that and I got that. And again, I was looking for post paint, couldn't find none. I was looking for colored chalk and poster paint. Would you believe three stores and their little stationery department did not have colored chalk or poster paint? I had to actually get this one, so. My arts attack is going to look a little different, I guess. But anyway, that's what I got. And if you're wondering how this opens, I'm actually open it like this 
Oh, it's gonna fall all over. Yeah, it's not like a uh, tackle box where you open up one end and it falls out. And open up one end and you know it's a handle. But um, anyway, go on YouTube, look for this thing called Artie Tech, and tell me after watching about ten clips of it, ten videos of it, you don't feel like doing art. <laughs>